Irish farm is my sister. Um, she came from a family of seven, seven of us, and she was married to David, and they have three beautiful children. She was beautiful, just absolutely beautiful inside and out, very kind, caring person. Everyone's kind of uh, worries or woes was Siobhan's worries and woes. She really was so, so kind. We were literally had just buried Dad. We were starting our grieving process for Dad. And he had been unwell and we'd been kind of focused on looking after him for a long time. Yeah, and then to get that phone call then the next day after his funeral was just something like you could never imagine in your wildest dreams would ever happen like the day after your father's funeral. I was at home, my phone rang and it was Siobhan's husband David and um, he said come quick Glenda Siobhan has collapsed. And then the paramedics arrived and they done everything they were absolutely fantastic that day and they tried for I'd say well over an hour they done absolutely everything they could for over an hour to try and unfortunately nothing they did was going to bring Siobhan back, she was gone. She had kind of said to some people, uh, her best friend during, the, during Dad's wake over the few days, um, that she had um, terrible chest pains. She said, I think I was having a panic attack because the pains passed. So the post-mortem results uh, revealed that Siobhan had a SCAD, a spontaneous coronary artery dissection, and it also showed up that um, she had one a couple of days before she had passed away, and five weeks previous, she also had, had one as well. But she didn't realise herself. You know, my dad wasn't well, we were looking after him, we knew, you know, he hadn't long left and all, and so we were all stressed, we were all worried, sick, and you know, we're looking after him and whatever, and um, three young kids, life's busy. We need to put the word out there that women need to look after their hearts. If we can prevent one family from this heartache, well then, we've done something good, like, you know. <laughs>